This is something you don't see every day. This is a fantastic idea. Uh, who came up with it? Actually, my grandfather uh, came up with the concept about two years ago. And, uh, and, and the idea was that we wanted to make boating fun for everybody. Uh, we wanted to give everybody the freedom to go out on the lake and, and have a good time, uh, no matter what their disability might be. Well, it's not only good for people in uh, wheelchairs, but also people in walkers or you know, uh, people in general who have a hard time getting on a boat. Yeah, yeah. It, I mean, it, it goes it goes nice uh, with our catamaran hull. You've got good stability, so boarding the boat's safe. Um, no matter if you're if you've got a scooter, a wheelchair, or, or if you're on a cane, uh, the stability makes the boat safe, so it's easy to board. Well, I can vouch for that. I've been out on uh, this hull many times in really rough water, and this is such a fantastic uh, lake hull. Yeah. Uh, unbelievable. Well, Adam, I'll tell you one thing that came in handy today. We're in uh, northern Indiana in October, and it's a little bit chilly, yeah, I have to say. Very chilly. This big windshield really came in handy. Really was very effective in blocking out the wind of the cockpit as well. And what we wanted to do, we want to make a windshield that give the boat a very sporty look, um, but we have to have that width for the uh, wheelchair room. Uh, but we wanted something that looked good, blocked the wind, and was practical. Good job. And uh, show me around the helm here. Uh, basically what we've done is we, we've mounted the Suzuki as the power on board. And we use the Suzuki smart gauges with a binnacle shifter. Uh, so if you're in your wheelchair, you can actually pull up to the steering wheel. You can, these chairs actually move, and you can pull up to the steering wheel and operate the boat solely from your chair if you'd like. So all the chairs in this boat can be moved around? Yes, the chairs can be moved to different positions. The wheelchairs can have uh, wheelchair locking mechanisms mounted wherever the customer would prefer. Uh, it's, it's all kind of up to the customer. The boat can be customized. Now, I notice I see a Garmin uh, color uh, GPS here. Is that standard? Yep, that, that is a standard option. That's uh, uh, the uh, GPS fish finder package in color. Um, and you can get the intercoastal or the, uh, the outer coastal package on that. Well, I'll tell you what. One of the things about this hull design is its roominess in the cockpit. This is uh, lots of room to room here, room to room rather. Yeah, we've basically got the width of a pontoon, so you've got all the room of a pontoon. Uh, you have the seating, uh, that kind of thing, uh, but you've got the smooth ride and the, the fast and uh, smooth ride of a speedboat. So you can go out and pull tubers, have a lot of fun, but you've got the practicality of, of, of the wheelchair and, uh, and, and being able to seat some people and have a good time on the water. Well, one of the other things I love is there's plenty of accessibility here for everybody else, too. Yeah, you've got a walk-on entry. You do not have to step over any, any gunnel of the boat or anything like that. It, it's all nice, clean, easy walkway. So you're not going to be cleaning upholstery footprints off the upholstery all the time? Nope. Well, that's fantastic. Yeah. Just finished testing the Splendor Freedom 239. Now, this is a very unusual boat. It's the first one I've ever seen. It has a full handicap accessible bow. It has a ramp that, that goes down by hydraulics. And it's also great for other people, uh, people in walkers and, and scooters and that. Now this is the perfect hull for that sort of setup. It's got a catamaran, a catamaran design, so it's very, very stable. And it's also extremely quick. We're, we're powered by the Suzuki 225 four-stroke, and we got on plane in 2.5 seconds, and we got to 30 miles an hour in five seconds, which is incredibly fast, with a top speed of 44.3 miles an hour. This boat really corners beautifully. Now I've been in this same hull in really rough conditions, three footers, and it really handles well. So uh, this is a great uh, big lake boat.